Okay, today guys we're going to be doing something a little bit different. We're going to go back to the technology side um, and this I did do a review I believe on my uh, Western Digital uh, MyCloud. This is the PR4100 series so it has the four drives. Um, today I am going to be as you see installing a drive. I had a drive go bad um, and uh, we're going to see what happens. So you can see I'm logged into the console here. I have a RAID 5, so I could lose one drive. It says it's degraded. Um, the nice thing that this has is uh, the lights down here. Um, it was actually red. Um, so these do change colors, um, which is nice. And I was able to pull, pull out the old drive and I threw that away um, a long time ago. So today we're going to be installing the new 3 terabyte. Uh, Western Digital Red Drive that we have right there. Um, and we're going to be doing that and seeing what happens. Uh, my guess is it should auto rebuild by itself since that's turned on um, and everything should be happy since this is more of a um, professional NAS. I use this to run my Plex um, for photos, videos, that kind of stuff. Um, and then backup as well for my several laptops. Um, so I'm going to install the drive here, and we'll see what happens. Okay, now that I have the drive out of the packaging, I'm just going to put it in here. It doesn't have drive slides, um, so you just kind of push it in. It does have a spring, and you'll push it in and close the door. And we'll see what happens here. So it's flashing uh, as it's spinning up that drive. It's all four online. Oh, and I didn't even click refresh. And you can see system is busy. Please wait for LED to turn solid blue. Let me hit refresh. And we'll go back to storage. So I'm not quite sure if it's auto rebuilding. I don't know if we can it looks like it's probably auto rebuilding. Um it'd be kinda nice if it said auto rebuilding. wondering if I have a bad slot or if it's still rebuilding. I'm not sure. This is kind of... It's still flashing over here. Oh, there it goes. Rebuilding volume. Okay. So that takes a bit longer than I thought it was going to. Um, I was kind of scared there that we actually lost a drive bay, not a, uh, a drive. Um, saying that this is just a, uh, just over a year old. As you can see on here as well, um, it gives you a percentage and how long it's going to take to rebuild. Um, and it also gives you the rebuild time over here as well. Um, so that's pretty nice. Um, like I said, it looks like it's going to auto rebuild as long as you have that checked. And uh, should be up and going. I mean, you will probably notice that I'm going to go back over here and see the CPU, I would imagine. Um, so I'm guessing if, um, you know, if you're going to be streaming Plex while you're rebuilding, it's obviously going to be slower due to disk uh, throughput and whatnot. Um, but it doesn't look to be killing it too bad. I'm sure it's the throughput more than anything else. And, uh, Let's go back to the storage. Looks like it's dropped down, but it's going to take a while to rebuild, as does any raid. Um, so thank you guys for watching. Um, I look forward to making my next video, and see you guys there.